Hello everyone, welcome to Science Gully. In today's video, we are going to see how to measure the soil moisture using soil moisture sensor FC28. As we all know, many cities of the world are facing water crisis. In such a situation, it becomes very important to use water effectively, especially in agriculture. Using soil moisture sensors, farmers can find out the water content in their soil and manage their irrigation systems effectively, reducing the wastage of water. Let's have a look at the sensor. It has two components. This is a two-legged probe which goes into the soil whose moisture has to be measured. As you can see, it has two header pins. These pins will be connected to the second component which is an amplifier. As you can see, the amplifier has four pins. AO, analog output, DO digital output. This means that it can be connected in two modes either analog or digital and the two other pins are ground and VCC. Let's understand the working of soil moisture sensor. These sensors are designed to estimate the volumetric content of water based on the dielectric constant. Now let me tell you what is dielectric constant? It is nothing but the soil's ability to transmit electricity. The dielectric constant of soil increases as the water content of the soil increases. When there is water in the soil, it will conduct more electricity. This means that there is low resistance. Dry soil conducts electricity poorly, which means that there will be more resistance. Now let's move on to the connections. This is the schematic which we are going to follow for the connections. First connect the header pin of the probe to the amplifier. Connect the pin AO of the amplifier to pin A0 of the Arduino board. Here I am connecting the amplifier in analog mode. And connect the pin VCC of the amplifier to pin 5 volt of the Arduino. And connect the pin ground of the amplifier to the ground of the Arduino. Connect the positive terminal of the buzzer to pin 13 and the negative terminal to ground. Connect your Arduino to the laptop using a USB cable to the serial port COM2. Let's have a look at the program. Here we are declaring the analog output pin as A0. Our sensor produces an output voltage according to the resistance of the probe and is made available to the analog output pin of the amplifier. This analog output is processed using ADC. The output of the sensor will be in the range of 0 to 1023. The moisture percentage can be calculated using this formula. If the moisture percentage is more than 50, we will receive an alarm through the buzzer. 50%. Now let us upload the program. 
done uploading. Here I have two samples of soil. One is wet soil and the other is dry soil. Now let's insert the probe in the dry soil. And it shows the moisture percent as 0%. Since it shows 0%, there is no moisture in this soil and we did not receive any alarm through the buzzer. Now I'm going to insert the probe in the wet soil. And you can see we are receiving an alarm from the buzzer. Now let's check the moisture percentage. It shows 68%. Since the moisture content in this soil is more than 50%, we received an alarm through the buzzer. Now let us insert the probe in the dry soil again. Now I'm going to increase the moisture content by adding some water. So I have added some water now. And you can see we receive an alarm through the buzzer. Now let us check the moisture value. So the moisture value has increased to 64%. Thank you for watching Science Gilly. I hope you enjoyed this video. Try making a smart irrigation system for your garden using soil moisture sensor. See you again in my next video. Till then bye bye.